Action. Please. The show starts in... the damn dude madman psycho mike welcoming you to this edition of my twisted world of masters of mayhem right here and you never know what you're going to find here when i'm on the air so on that note i want you to sit back rip the top off a cold one roll up a fatty and enjoy this edition of psycho mike's twisted world of masters of mayhem But I just got to know one thing. Are you ready? No! I said, are you ready? It's Russell from War! And you're watching Psycho Mike kicking ass! Big Dave the Mighty from War, and you're watching Psycho Mike kicking ass on Cleveland, Ohio, the Masters of Mayhem Wrestling, the only professional wrestling that has been here in the last five years, where you are to go now. Bye! Hey, we're going to watch Masters of Mayhem Wrestling. Masters of Mayhem Wrestling. Where you want to be. Where you want to be. Bye. Mr. Mike, 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 Mr. Then alongside sensational summer. Cleveland, what's happening? It's the tattooed madman cycle my cologne team walls cat. Stay tuned, Cleveland. Thank you. This thing. What's happening, Cleveland? It's the tattooed madman cycle Mike. Here along with Team Walls, Bobcat. We'll see that fight. Don't forget to see me down here at Cleveland and Madness Mayhem. Cleveland! It's Tater! I'm here! Big hair wrestling! You can't beat me with a stick! You can't whip me with a switch! Don't even try! You know what I'm breaking? Yeah! Macho Man Randy Savage. And you are watching the Masters of Mayhem in Cleveland, Ohio. Whoa, yeah! Dig it! Yeah! You're in all the time! What? What? Hallelujah! We got a brand new dance! It's called a bird! This is the Aaron Sheik. You are watching Master Maho uh, wrestling. Don't talk. This is the Aaron Sheik, Olympic champion, WWF champion, world champion, and you are watching Master Master of the Wrestling Maha. No, especially in the Cleveland, Ohio, people know Aaron Sheik was a champion, and still I'm a champion. Olympic, my pleasure to have come to the Cleveland, Ohio, to show all my wrestling fans. Aaron Sheik was a champion, and still I'm champion. Look at me, Ya Allah.
Now you know what I'm talking about. I'm the real champion. Cleveland, Ohio, my intelligent wrestling fans know about the Iron Sheik. This is Axe Demolition, and you're watching the Masters of Mayhem Wrestling. Go Mike, and you're watching Masters of Mayhem Wrestling. This is Typhoon and that's a disaster. You're watching Masters of Mayhem Wrestling. <laughs> Do people think of Masters of Mayhem Wrestling after just one viewing? Yes. Oh, <laughs> I like it. And so will you. Check out Masters of Mayhem Wrestling, Music, and Chaos. Check out Psycho Mike's Twisted World of Masters of Mayhem Underground TV. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Are we on? <laughs> <laughs> Of course we are. It's time! I want you to sit back, rip the top off a cold one, roll up a fatty, and enjoy this edition of Psycho Mike's Twisted World of Masters of Mayhem Under... <sighs> Underground TV. <laughs> <laughs> Whee! All highlights. So, sit back, rip the top off the cord, and enjoy this week's edition of Back to the Mayhem Wrestling. Oh, and by the way, Happy New Year! Come into the ring in just a moment or two for more exciting fucking action.
Former professional wrestler Psycho Mike, now the author of nine books. Two no-holds-barred books about his wrestling career, one cookbook. Two books of Psycho Mike Muses. Two coloring books. An autobiography. And one book about the wrestling he grew up watching as a kid. The NWF. All these titles are available on the website listed or at Amazon.com. The Twisted World of Psycho Mike is now in books. Check it out. The tag team match and it's our main event of the evening. <laughs> Introducing the first team and they need no introduction. Peter Avalon and Ray Rosad, P. P. Ray! Yes, Ray from Peter! Ray, it's all for Peter! And their opponents to my right, take a drink! Main event of the evening is underway. P.P. Ray versus Darby Allen and Priscilla Kelly. Boy, has the bar wrestling faithful been waiting a long time for the return of Peter Avalon. Peter Avalon looking better than ever. Dollars in his waistband. He hasn't missed a day in the gym. Absolutely not. He's probably spent more time in the gym uh, while recovering from injury. Pistol Pete, I like to call him. Quick on the draw. Powerful all the way through to the end. And he's loaded. Now he wants the patrons of bar wrestling to be loaded. Fully loaded. Darby Allen, The bullets while. are in the chamber. And he'll pistol whip you too. He won't play fair either. He took advantage of Darby Allen, just kicked him right in the stomach. He's a gunslinger. Pistol Pete, man. Pistol. Pistol with a shoulder tackle. No, no, sir. Darby Allen tries to trip him, misses. Leapfrog. Look at the quickness of both of these men. Whoa, look at that, Olita. Darby Allen. He's like a demonic ballerina. Well, I said it for you, Melissa. Punk Rock Peter Pan is Darby Allen. Got his little boots. Yeah, but I think that uh, if, he's the, if he's the Punk Rock Peter Pan, then that would make Ray Rose as Captain Hook for sure. Definitely. Peter is me. <laughs> Absolutely. That would make the Bootleg Theater Neverland. <laughs> Peter is look good in a striped shirt. But he doesn't like wearing shirts, unfortunately. Darby Allen now making a tag to his partner, both in the ring and in life, Priscilla Kelly. She is fierce too, man. She's a wild banshee. Back elbow from Priscilla Kelly. Wow. Awesome takedown. Variation of an Olita. Priscilla Kelly, just like that, up on the middle rope. She misses, but she rolls out of it. Forward roll into a kick. Wow. Connecting hard. 
and <laughs> doesn't even go for the cover. She just gets right on top. She knew, well, you know what? That was smart. She knew she probably wasn't going to get a three count. Yeah. So she just started landing right hands. Just inflict more damage. They're playing the long game. Oh, no, wait a minute. Oh, no. Oh, no. What? What's this all about? Well, I can't, I can't comment on that. My mama's watching. I don't, I don't know. There's some sort of fish hook. Oh, damn it. Slut shaming here in the bar. We welcome sluts. We love sluts. I'm a slut. Big slap from Priscilla Kelly. Peter Avalon does not take too kindly to someone hurting the Captain Hook to his shmee. Peter Shmee. Remember that, everyone. Darby Allen, meanwhile. Jeez, Peter Avalon likes to rock the boat. Darby Allen with a roll up there, spinning around. He's like he's a he's like a demonic Barishnikov. <laughs> Taking turns now. Damn this. Uh, Ooh. Very scary duo here, working well as a tandem. Darby Allen and Priscilla Kelly. Unorthodox to say the least. But man, they're an effective team. Damn! There it is! No. And I don't think PP Ray have ever faced a team like this. I, I guess you they're call them very, very confused. Flip Buster. They don't know what to they don't know what to make of this team. Well, and don't forget, PP Ray, uh, they haven't been a unit for quite a while. That's, that's no pun intended there. Unit? Oh, you're talking, man, that was a dick joke? Well, this is bar wrestling. The bar is open, ladies and oh, gentlemen. Oh, no! Oh, no, Darby Allen tasted. Hey, let's add a rule to the bar wrestling drinking game. Anytime an ass hits somebody in the face, take a drink. Oh, oh come on. We don't want anyone. We're not encouraging alcohol poisoning, Kevin. All right, so that's not, we're not, we're not going to do okay. that rule. Everything in moderation here. All right, all right. Forget the rule. Forget it, guys. But there's no moderation in violence because P.P. Ray with a double team on Darby Allen there. Peter and Ray swim the arms, then get her in a very precarious position. Ooh. Oh, a meeting of the minds. Smart. Priscilla Kelly's fierce, smart. Agile, agile. Agile. Kind of sick. A little twisted. Little, Ooh. She's a twisted sister, I'll tell you that much. Darby Allen off oh, the ropes. Right in position. Peter Avalon didn't see it coming. Oh, but he didn't see that super kick coming. Oh my god, Ray lost his money. Knox, you better not keep that. Knocked the dollars right out of his pants. Shook his money maker. He certainly did, Loudon. PP Ray is having a hard time deciphering yeah, the, I mean, this, the, the, the strategy of their opponents here. What are they gonna do? How will they get out of this one? I don't know, they've, it's been so long since they've gotten together here at Bar Wrestling. Minute, Peter's got a gun. Uh-oh. Looks like a little... Look at a little Tarantino movie going on here. Double team move, oh. PP Ray. High impact maneuver, nicely done. Darby Allen rolling to the outside, but they're not paying attention to his partner. Ooh. Another jumping drop kick from the sky. Death from above. Beautiful kick connecting with Ray Rosas. Kelly continuing her attack on both members of PP Ray. But they, they saw that coming. 
I don't know, Priscilla Kelly might be, she might be enough to take PP right down by herself. Impressive half and half suplex. Taking down Ray Rosas, but now. That shot was to the newly repaired jaw of Peter Avalon. And now. Headbutt, right to the dollar bills. Right that, to the bits. That's not the, that's not the tip he was looking for. And a head, scissor, head scissor takeover from the top rope, Peter Avalon onto Ray Rosas. PP Ray. PP Ray's in trouble. They're in trouble. This is not how you want to make your comeback here. This is not how you want to return to bar wrestling. This is their home turf. They're being defiled on their own home turf. What is he, is he looking for his, mu is, is Ray Rosas looking for his muffler? Muffler fell out, Daddy. Did his muffler fall out? His muffler fell out. No! Oh, no, nah, no, nah, wait a minute now. Peter I have it on. Now I have to take a drink. Peter just got a face full of shit. Now I have to take a drink. Oh, no, hell, there's an STO from Priscilla. Hooks the leg. Oh, and poopy hands is that a was, loser. That was a defacement of PP Ray. They were defiled. What a vile and vulgar display by these two miscreants. Miscreants of excrement. I don't know what to make of this, Kevin. When one gazes into the abyss long enough, eventually the abyss gazes back. PP Ray are covered in putrid light. Peter and Ray played a dangerous game with a dangerous group. Darby Allen and Priscilla Kelly lured Ladies. them in and used them exactly how they wanted to. Ladies and gentlemen, I gotta go wash my hands. Somebody get me a wet nap. For Killer Kevin Condren, my name is Loud and Noxious. Until next time, the bar is closed. Peace, I'm out of here.
there's the bell, loud and obnoxious. This is the, one of the wildest shows I've been a part of this year. But it's about to get a little crazy. Bar wrestling is always a very wild show. It's a wild time that is had by all. But right here, we are looking at an intergender tag team match like never before. We've got the world's cutest tag team and possibly the world's scariest. That's right, Decay, made up of Rosemary and Abyss. And the world's cutest tag team, made up of Candice LeRae, AKA Candice Wrestling, and Joey Ryan. Joey Ryan has put his lollipop into a fan's mouth. He's oiled himself up. There's been dancing, there's been singing. There's been no wrestling. We well, gotta be oiled up, Kev, before you get in that ring. You're damn right about that, and nobody knows more about body oil than Joey Ryan. Of course he's in the ring right now, but still. Candace uh, choosing uh, to kick that out. The fans here at Bar Wrestling are heavily in favor of the world's cutest tag team. Well, I'd like to say that this is the world's cutest tag team's home turf, so oh, to say. Oh, sure is, sure is. But cuteness isn't going to win this match, that's for sure. Well, if it were, I would declare Abyss the loser. I mean, if cuteness won matches, I'd be a world heavyweight champ. It's damn straight. Damn, damn, damn straight, Adam. You're a cute man. But I'm not. I'm back here doing commentary with you, no. Kev. And this isn't about you. This isn't about how cute of a man you are, Loudon. This is about the world's cutest tag team. And whether or not Abyss is going to touch Joey Ryan's dick. doesn't know what to make of Joey's penis. It's like one monster looking at another. A, a one-eyed monster, so to say. A one-eyed, purple-headed yogurt slinger. Very famous penis that Joey Ryan that, has. That was a little too descriptive, Ken. My name's not Ken Loudon. Now he's asking Rosemary to touch his dick. From what I understand, Rosemary identifies, uh, there are several of her in there. I don't know if any version of them wants to come out and play, but I guess we'll find out. She's gonna do it. I don't know if I'd want Rosemary to be the one. I don't know, Loudon. I mean, what do you think is going to happen here? She's... Rosemary doesn't seem to. She doesn't seem to have her mind made up. Either you grab the dick or you don't, honey, but you got to shit or get off the pot. Oh, and there's a punch, and Joey just immediately told her no. Rosemary now, but a reversal by Joey. Rosemary with a forearm to Joey Ryan's face. Rosemary showing some toughness here. And Joey Ryan showing some quickness. But Rosemary's gonna use the ropes to her advantage at this point. Oh my. Sort of like a tarantula there, but not quite. But but it is an illegal maneuver. Well, yeah, that's right. She's got him in the ropes, and there's Rick Knox with the five count. 
and Rosemary breaks the hold. Rosemary to the outside. Uh, Louder, Rosemary is one of the more eclectic performers that I've ever seen. Eclectic. It's interesting. And she just takes a bis in. Rosemary with a flying forearm into the corner. Here goes Big Abyss. Oh, and he missed Joey Ryan. Joey's up and it. Oh, bad, bad decision. Should have known better, Abyss. He's gonna, he's gonna ruin his patella doing that. Abyss with a miss. Oh, and there's a drop toe hold on the weakened knee. And a adorable <laughs> I'm little sure senton. I'm not sure how much that cute little senton did to Abyss. Well, the world's cutest tag team is known for being adorable. But Candace Wrestling, uh, oh. she's extremely tough. I don't know if she's tough enough to put up with a choke slam from Abyss. He's got her goozled, and he was from a kneeling position, too. Oh, Candace just slides out of it. Oh. And there goes Rosemary down on the apron. Smart oh. the apron. Smart move by Candace. Oh. Joey Ryan's got Candace up in a rack. He's using her as a oh. weapon. Yes! Joey Ryan just DVD'd her onto the Abyss. Two and no. Candace runs in a hurry, making that tag. Candace tags Joey back in. Now Joey lining up with the shots. Joey Ryan throwing shots at Abyss. It's the ropes. Oh, and there's oh, a close wow. line. I don't envy Joey here. He looks like he's gonna have to do the heavy lifting for his team. And Abyss is a, he's a massive giant. That's redundant, I know, but it bears repeating. Was that a band in the 90s? They might be, they might be gigantic giants. He's Abyss. a monster, he's a monster, but so is my cat. Oh, speaking of which, Abyss is throwing monster punches to the stomach of Joey Ryan. Abyss looks like he's in a foul mood. Oh, he doesn't like dick games. And, I mean, how would you feel if an iron penis crushed your kneecap, Larry? That would be, that, but I said, I think that's a penis to the patella. Have you ever had a penis on your patella? Thank God, no. Neither have I. But Abyss has, and after tonight, Abyss is a changed monster. Loud it. His penis to patella virginity hath been taken. Halloween will never be. Halloweeny will never be the same. Happy <laughs> that one. A night full of puns here in Baldwin we've Park, California. Seen, we've seen the lighting come down off the ceiling. We've seen high impact moves on the bar. We've seen the bar raised, then lowered again. Joy Ryan into the ropes. And he slips out of the slam. And Abyss with a back elbow. Oh no, oh no! no! And his skull has to be ruined. That'll send you to the black hole and back. <laughs> Abyss's head must be full of dark matter. And Abyss now desperate for a tag to Rosemary. Meanwhile, Joey tags Candace. And, and here we go. Here come the wicked witches. I didn't use my bitch card on that one. You didn't use your bitch card. And, and it's a damn good thing you didn't, because if either one of them heard you say that word, they might beat your ass. Yeah, well, I would have run for it, so. Oh, and a headbutt from Rosemary. <laughs> Rosemary is a vicious, vicious person. I can just tell by looking at that psychotic face. And Rosemary with a splash. T-Bone suplex! She's, she's woman handling Candace. Two, and no! Candace kicks out. Candace showing some fight, Loudon. She's got a lot of fight. We've seen Candace fight. We've seen her have some incredible matches here at Bar Wrestling. And now Candace up in the rack position. And Candace slides out. She's gonna oh no! And she's gonna have to use her, her quickness and her skill. She just grabbed her between the legs, but didn't seem to go anywhere. Candace now got both feet up and just pushed Rosemary down. Candace with a running kick! Wow, that was lightning quick. Two and there! No! Oh, Rosemary rises from the dead. From the up from the graveyard. Like she looks like one of the misfits. Rosemary with a swinging close line. Oh, and there's a coat breaker from Candace. Groggy, here comes Joey now to take advantage of this situation. And now they're gonna go for, is that, they're gonna go for the lawn dart. And there she goes, DDT. Beautiful tandem offense from the world's cutest tag team. One, two, and Abyss just kicks Joey Ryan in the head. Joey had to waste a little bit of time because he had to pull Rosemary to the center of the ring. Joey with a jawjacker on Abyss. 
Joey now picks Candace up, and again, he's using her as a weapon. Oh, oh no, but it backfired. The weapon backfired. Joey relied a little too much on using Candace as a javelin. And Abyss, the veteran, the slow, methodical Whoa! monster. The sky is going to come down here. She's got Abyss by the balls. Oh, my God. Spear. Oh, wow. Rosemary just came out of nowhere. That quieted Candace down real quick. Rosemary now flicking her hand. She's got that crazy look on her eyes like there's something wrong. Candace though, whoa! She just drove Rosemary's head oh. into Joey Ryan's dick Imagine. and Rosemary is out cold. Imagine going head first into a solid concrete gargoyle. I've never heard Joey Ryan's penis called a gargoyle before, but that's why there's a first time for everything here at Bar Wrestling. This is Halloween. Candace LeRae is fighting to get up, and she throws a clothesline. Cute little chops, adorable attacks. Joey Ryan's Abyss. on the ground, but Abyss is about to fall. Abyss. Oh, no! No, 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 no! no, no. Biggest black hole slam I have ever seen! We just saw the whole universe implode. There's the super kick lollipop action! And Abyss goes down! How many? Rosemary with a kick! Boomplex! 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 Yes! Oh, I guess I guess that answers how many licks does it take to get to the center of a Tootsie Pop? Blow pop, Loudon! It's a blow pop! And Joey Ryan, he's calling for it! What's it, what? He's got... Oh no! Is this plunder, Kev? Does he have a bag of plunder? Oh, you bet he does! Trick or treat time right now! He's oh, got the bag. is baggie. it gonna be gummy bears? Is it gonna be candy corn? If I'd have known! Oh, it's Flux! No! It's, no! it's Legos! It's even worse than candy corn! Loudon, I don't know if you have children, if you've ever stepped on a Lego, if, if you've ever faced that pain. But this, this is too much. Well, I've been called a Lego maniac in the past, but I wouldn't want to be part of this. Please, no. Please tell me this isn't happening. Back elbow from Joy Ryan, and he does not want to get choke slam. I know it's... Oh, wait a minute! Wait a minute, Abyss is fighting it, but he's going to make him touch his dick! He's going to do it! He's going to do it! Yes! Oh, I know it's Halloween, but this is too scary even he's, for me! And Joy Ryan has him in the U-Port Plex, but can he get him over? Oh! On the Legos! On the Legos! The U-Port Plex connects! Joey Ryan now! He just pulled out another blow pop! Oh, Rosemary with the mist! She caught him, and the blow pop goes down. And now Rosemary with Joey Ryan. F5! She, she F5s him. Three! Decay is your winner! There's no need to fear! Psycho Mike is here! Well, I'll tell you what, they just don't get any more psycho than Psycho Mike. That boy ain't right.
the Tattooed Madman Psycho Mike, and this has been my Twisted World of Masters of Mayhem. Part-time crazy, 100% psycho. Thank you very much for joining me. See you on the next episode of Psycho Mike's Twisted World of Masters of Mayhem. So, stay sick, turn blue, scratch glass, climb walls, but most importantly, do it while you can. Don't get caught, <laughs> and stay fucking crazy. Huh? Importantly, do it while you can. Don't get caught. <laughs> Stay fucking crazy. No, no, no. Son of a bitch. <laughs>